20 years old and killed serving his country the day after Memorial Day. A local soldier is coming home. That story tops our news this midday. Thank you for joining us, everyone. I'm Ron Corning. Bringing home a hero. Today, a 20-year-old U.S. Army private killed in Afghanistan is welcomed home at the Naval Air Station Joint Reserve Base. Channel 8's Cynthia Vega is joining us live from Fort Worth with more on this story. Cynthia? Good afternoon to you, Ron. A very somber scene here this morning. The reminder the war in Afghanistan continues and has taken the life of a North Texas soldier fighting it. Take a closer look earlier this morning and you will see a small private plane arriving here bringing home the body of 20-year-old U.S. Army Private Andrew Krippner of Garland. On arrival, full military honors, including water cannons, greeted him, along with many tearful family members, all here from Garland. Krippner's coffin carefully hoisted from the plane. From here, the Patriot Guard will escort his coffin to the Wrestling Funeral Home in Dallas. Krippner died of wounds suffered while fighting in northern Afghanistan, once enemies attacked with an improvised explosive device. Krippner was assigned to the 2nd Battalion, 27th Infantry Region, 3rd Brigade, combat team. He is the 159th service member killed in action this year. Live in Fort Worth, I'm Cynthia Megan, Channel 8 News. All right, Cynthia, thank